Hello Leo, welcome to my channel. Pretty Aura here. I'm here to do your emergency room reading. This is going to be about what in your energy needs to be addressed immediately and what cannot wait. Um, during the course of this reading, I'm going to be making recommendations um, on how to attack these issues head on. A lot of the times our spiritual issues manifest as physical and mental issues. So I'm here to bridge that gap and help you to... Um, fix any issues okay um you're watching this video if you are leo sun moon or rising even venus i encourage you to watch all your placements um <clears throat> you're also watching this video if you're looking for answers about a leo um and the prescription will be in the comment section okay i'm gonna pin it all right leo so in the um in the mental position Okay, it's a lot of it's a lot of um, trying to stay on top energy. Okay, trying to balance your 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 masculine and feminine energies. Um, I heard that somebody I I heard um, there's there's a mental issue. Okay, um, someone may have even been diagnosed with them with a mental issue, but it's really like trying to um, have a coming together of of your masculine and feminine energies or just trying to balance okay so you may be um fighting with the mental instability where well you're not actually fighting you're making a dedicated effort to um balance your energies you see here okay we have a man and a woman and a man and a woman um you could also for some of you guys be dedicated to um healing the 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 family issues between your mom and your dad or your 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 husband or your wife okay so there's a there's an energy of really trying to nurture yourself and making a dedicated effort to mentally stay on top and be stable and balanced okay this looks good for a lot of you guys there's someone who literally is turning their back to the drama and putting their um energy into their artistry whether it be painting rapping singing drawing whatever it is that um that how you express yourself creatively it looks like you are literally trying to change your focus and heal change your fo focus and turning your back towards whatever drama okay for some of you you're actually looking to either heal from a, a relationship and walk away from a person or putting your focus into coming together with the person okay let's get more information so mentally for leo someone's um right so we have community here and then we have loyal heart at the bottom of the deck so here goes that double energy too um you 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 could be actually even in the in the process of trying to mentally heal things with your children as well okay so this is a beautiful energy this is about um uh, things on a home front um and 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 also um speaking on a home front as far as your higher self which is beautiful okay trying to trying to search your soul trying to make it right with the individuals that are in your family or right a lot of doubles type energy so this could be concerning a gemini or a libra or you may have those um placements in your chart Yeah, with imagining go the distance, it's like you guys are really like, um, <clears throat> I just heard endurance, really trying to fight the good fight in reference to your mental stability. So this is good. Um, if you are looking to cut cords or heal from something and, you, and you, the way you're going to heal it is actually to move away from it, then you will want to use black obsidian and or black kyanite um, to cut cords. In order to, um, if you want to heal something with someone, um, uh, 
I would say to use um, throat chakra crystals, any throat chakra crystals, just so that, you know, um, with this uh, mental energy of trying to balance, okay, you may have the tendency to go off on people or the tendency to maybe say something and be misunderstood because of what's going on in your mind. It looks like you're balancing that pretty well. But if, you know, if not, I would really, um, I would really use throat chakra crystal so you can, um, communicate clearly and effectively, okay? Surrender to play. Take a break from overthinking a goal. Do something fun. Playtime is play is a time of recreation and rejuvenation. So Leo, it may have it may be that you have been and look at the bottom of the deck we have surrender resentments so holding on to resentments only poisons you try to forgive others for their shortcomings and keep moving forward towards positive situations in life and so this is what i was saying about maybe trying to cut cords with someone right you you maybe trying to move away from family drama or move away from you know a relationship that you were in or even move away from you know uh toxic family members or relationships period friendships or what have you right but in this you know spirit is asking you just to release resentments against these people um and uh, and a lot of and, and a lot of it you know um I would say get carnelian, okay? Get carnelian. Carnelian is it will also help you to um channel some of your create creative energy. With this surrender to play, it's like you guys are probably, you know, really I, I feel a dedicated effort to change your life, especially men especially mentally. And so you may be forgetting to actually have fun and um enjoy, enjoy life. Okay. Spiritually, you may be learning and learning more about spirituality. Okay. For some of you guys, you may spiritually be at war with um someone. With the two fives here, um, you you five five, and then you also have five right here. So that's five five five. There's change coming, Leo. There's change coming, and I think you are aware of this, and that's why you're trying to stay on top and get yourself together. You may be fighting spiritually with somebody. I just heard that someone doesn't know <laughs> that they're fighting spiritually with someone. But if you are a person who's staying up late at night, I just heard definitely, definitely you. Um, think about how you feel during around the full moon okay which is now because this is going to tell you for someone else your cycle something about your cycle being irregular or your cycle is not right um and you may want to check into that okay um someone here spiritually just gave an offering of flowers to um to your deity or whoever it is that you are um thinking about I mean whoever it is that you're working with spiritually okay there's someone who seems like they're trying to teach their kids um more about spirituality as well um you guys watch your pets around your altars okay watch your pets around the altar So spiritually, we have not for you, okay? So someone, <clears throat> and also round and round. There's someone who may be fighting spiritually with, um, with a person who they may have thought was their friend or may have thought that, that you know, in a, may have been in a relationship with this person and you don't even realize, okay? But it's like you're coming into... Um, coming into the the realization that this person may even be something like an enemy okay um you also have here round and round at the bottom of the deck so whatever this is is like 
this could be a person who you're always going through some BS with. There's also an energy of, you know, someone connecting with their higher self and learning like, listen, I keep going through these cycles in life. I'm going to make a dedicated effort to balance my emotions so that I don't have to continue these negative cycles. OK, and that's where this teach is coming from, because it's like you're learning. You're learning like, look, if I want to go ahead in life, this is do or die. This is when to lose. Do I if I keep doing the same um if I keep making the same mistakes, I'm going to continue in this in this vicious cycle, okay? So it's like learning what's not for you. Learning what you what doesn't serve you. Releasing what doesn't serve you with the knife here, cutting out things that don't serve you, okay? Surrender denial. Accept people and situations exactly as they are without denying the difficulties. Then you can see things clearly and make the best decisions. So Leo, like I said, there's somebody in your life that you need to let go. Okay? I'm even being called to say they might even be, be working on you spiritually behind your back. But even if not, okay, you would need a personal reading for that. But even if not, regardless to what, there's a need to cut cut people off. And 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 don't deny what you're seeing in reference to this person, please. Okay? Please. Because this is a this is a round and round cycle, and this person is not for you. Okay, we see that here. They're not for you. Surrender to inner peace. So <clears throat> Cultivate inner peace on a daily basis. Meditation will work um, very well for you guys, okay? And you know what? Here in the physical position, we do have, you may even be meditating, okay? You guys may even be meditating. There's something about the color purple that I want to bring attention to. Um, your third eye, okay? Yes, Um, there's a little bit of, I want to, I want to tell you, Leo, that while you are working on yourself, you should probably, um, get a piece of selenite. Okay. This is going to, this is going to bring inner peace, right? But while, while you're working on yourself, don't do it in a way where it's like, cause I feel like you're a little bit unforgiving of yourself. You second guess yourself. You have anxiety. Like you, you're, you're looking to change your life and in making these decisions, right? To change your life. Please know that you're human, okay? And you're gonna make mistakes. Don't be so hard on yourself, okay? Because you are making these changes in your life so that you can have a peaceful life. But if you're going through a lot of inner conflict or stressing yourself out while making these changes, then you are defeating the purpose, Leo, okay? Okay, over here in a physical position, there's somebody who's um who's who's their bottom of their legs is like it's the your calves are feeling a little weak or shaky or you could be working out using your calves it could be you could be focusing on your legs um the treadmill the treadmill For some of you guys, you're you're physically on autopilot. You may get up and go to work every day or you may do the same things every day. It's like a routine type thing. And this may be how you're helping to balance yourself by putting yourself on some sort of routine, okay? Physical, 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 physical for Leo, physical for Leo, yin. Okay, this is about receiving. This is about receiving. This is about receiving. So you guys are, you know, a lot of you guys are physically trying to um, receive information from the universe. Okay, this is, this is, this is um, trusting. Okay, listening for an inner voice. Building blocks is at the bottom of the deck. I really feel like you guys are collecting your thoughts, okay? There's also an energy of someone in the gym, okay? There's, there's a treadmill energy uh, running up the steps. There's someone's, your legs, I'm getting, <clears throat> there's something about your legs. Physically, there's somebody who doesn't even want to get up and get dressed every day, Um It's a carefree, it's a carefree type energy though. 
okay? It's a carefree type of energy because it's like you're focused on trying to get your mental together. You don't even care about being cute, right? Physical. Yeah. <clears throat> you guys are putting um, putting things out into the universe, okay? It's, uh, well, receiving from the universe, um, going every day. I feel like you guys may, a lot of you guys may be essential workers. You guys may literally be trying to, um, manifest money or getting to the money, um, focusing on your wealth. Okay. Using the law of attraction, you guys could be, um, Spiritually asking the universe for things. Surrender to spirit. Once you have done everything you can to achieve a goal, turn the situation over to the divine. Let spirit work its magic for you. So yes, like I said, you guys are putting out there to the universe. Like, listen, universe, I want this. And then being open to receiving it. Okay? I want to say to make sure that you guys are... You know, physically, somebody who's sleeping is like not really getting enough rest because then they're still thinking mentally. I don't, I don't know if that makes sense, but it's like your mind is not resting. Meditation will be very, very important to you guys. Okay. Surrender comparisons with other people. Keep your eyes focused and trained on yourself. Focus on your own strengths, attractiveness, and power. So this is probably why I'm feeling like you're not resting mentally. Probably because you have to, you're you're in this gotta gotta get it type of energy, Leo, where it's like, listen, you still want to enjoy life. You still want to enjoy life. You're working on balancing your emotions. You're working on working on your mental stability, right? But then you have to get rid of these certain people around you, okay? And then also. Don't burn yourself out physically trying to uh, bring in your your fruits, the fruits of your labor, because they're going to come in, okay? You just need to be open to receiving from spirit. Um, don't overwork yourself or burn yourself out, okay? There could be someone who's working out because they want to look a certain way, okay? And there's a, there's, a, there's a feeling of a TikTok energy, like time, like time is of the essence, right? Okay, Leo, I would definitely um, listen to um, relaxing vibrations, some type, some relaxing vibrations on YouTube, okay? I hope that helped, Leo.